Hey everyone, so it has been somewhere around seven or so months since I got this beautiful baby boy from Petco. Uh, it's hard to believe it's already been seven months or so. You can see he has really, really grown. And he is, he might even be a half moon. I'm going to say that he's probably a half moon. Uh, as once he lets his fin all, fins all the way out, they are nice giant and flowy of course now he's gonna hide on us here all right there we he is his white and red uh white bodied and then his fins are all nice and red here uh so we have him in this 45 gallon tank here with some platies corys some guppies uh one shrimp that has survived a long long time in that corner, that one is a survivor of a shrimp. A uh, ghost shrimp, that is. Uh, he was in here with over 50 guppies at one point, uh, who are all now back outside in their pond. Uh, yeah, I mean, he has not bothered anybody. He just does his own thing. He loves to explore the tank. Uh, I mean, you can see, if you guys remember how small he, how small he was when we first got him. And he's on hide again. Uh, let's see, he loves to explore everything. Uh, I mean, he was super duper tiny. We had him in a one gallon tank when I first got him because he was so small. Didn't want him to get lost in the tank. Uh, then he got upgraded and then upgraded again. So now he's in this 45. Uh, when we first put him in here, he, he did follow. Never really attacked anybody else, but he was following the guppies around. Uh, so now he kind of does his own thing for the most part. He is, he's actually quite fun to watch too. Even being a bigger thin beta, who in my experience are usually a bit on the lazy side, he is not, he's always moving. He always does his own thing. So once he, he's beautiful, and once he puts those fins all the way out, he's, he's just downright gorgeous. Like I said, I'm thinking he is a half moon here. Uh, of course, when you get the baby betas from Petco or wherever, you don't really know what they're going to be. Usually they're, they're just your standard beta. Uh, you know, but he turned out to be nice and big finned. And he is still curious at times. He still does chase other guppies every now and then. He did not, he does not attack them. So there, he just kind of follows them. And then the guppies kind of run away. Uh, but most of the time, though, he does his own thing and explores the tank. And again, he is in a 45-gallon tank here, so he's a good-sized tank to explore. Um, these guppies will be going back outside once I can catch them. They just, they're smart little boogers, and once they see the net, they swim away. And this is being a good-sized tank. Not a big tank, but a good-sized tank. They're just hard to catch in here, a tall tank. Yeah, so it's been about seven or eight months or so. You can see he has grown quite a bit. I see he's pretty much full grown now. Uh, but he could live, he could probably live another three or four years. And your typical lifespan is somewhere around three or four years. So he's probably some, I'm going to guess he's somewhere around a year old. Uh, Ten months to like a year old. So I'm sure when I got him, he was at least a month or two. So, so yeah, that is the update, the about seven month update on my baby beta boy. Thank you guys all very much for watching. Hope you guys have a good one. As always, I appreciate it. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.